So things that we're putting on our food, especially when we think we're doing healthy things like salad, um, you know, here is a dressing right here. 520 milligrams of sodium, you know, per two tablespoons. Well, you know, I don't even know how many people out there are actually measuring out two tablespoons or if they're putting a whole lot more in there. So 520 milligrams you would not expect to get in your salad. Um, and then, so dressing, a lot of times people, someone's like, well, I'm gonna do a fat-free version. A lot of times if you go light or fat-free, Usually the trade-off for that is going to be, you know, possibly higher carbs, higher sodium, higher sugar. Um, it's not in all cases, but it's in enough cases to be mindful. You know, even if we're saying Italian dressing, you know, here's 18 uh, grams of fat, right? Um, per Now this one's only 170 milligrams of sodium, but again, you know, 18 grams of fat in that versus, you know, there's another one, it's still not a light, and there's seven grams of fat. So again, just kind of, you know, buyer beware. You know, um, but dressings, dips, things that we just kind of mindlessly consume, um, you know, two tablespoons of this prepared is 240 milligrams of sodium. Not to mention, what are you putting with this? Is it already some kind of chip or you know, nacho or something that's already salted, you very well, and two tablespoons is nothing, man. You, you sit down, you have five, ten chips, and before you know it, you know, if I really, you know, wanted to, I'd just go another few aisles over, look at how much sodium is in 10 or 11 chips, you know, compared to this, I wouldn't be surprised if you're easily sitting at, you know, half of the sodium that you need for the whole day, and something that we would mindlessly do while we're waiting for the burgers to get off the grill. So, um, again, just trying to create some more mindful, you know, eating, a conscious dining experience. It's all the same thing. Just stopping, pausing, and realizing what we're doing um, and to what degree. Um, you know, and, and again, telling people, this is a journey when you go to do better for yourself. It is all this mindless, uneducated eating that we're doing and the weight that we're putting on and the harm that we're doing to our body isn't happening overnight. So, as you make the step to start paying attention to what you eat or you're walking or you're counting steps and then you're taking it to the next level and you're getting into the gym, don't have the pressure for that to happen overnight either. Um, you know, the same way everything happened before, just through time and negligence, it's going to be time and deliberate positive, you know, um, activities that will allow to, you know, for you to achieve positive results. So.